Went from one to one to one and done And I can't replace you Wait, what can I do when I can't have you? Admin day, as you do. And by admin, I mean editing. I hate picking up the camera on days like this because I'm just like, I want to be fun for you. Like, I want to do something. I want to get out and have fun because it's not even like I'm having a cozy day. I'm literally just <laughs> editing. And um, you're going to get sick of it. You really are. I mean, I already am. No, I'm not sick of editing because I love it. I love pumping out content for you. I don't want to sit and edit the same video every day. So I feel like I'm doing it for your sake as in, like, I don't want you guys to get bored and, like, leave me alone. Fear of loneliness. But I also don't want to get bored editing because then I'm, like, going to hate it. the bottom line of it. We are going to be going out at some point today. It's already, like, half three, I think. Let me actually check. Be right back. It's half three. And all I've done is have a shower, have a cup of tea, and edit. Who's that? Who's that now? Revolut. Okay, babes. Don't need to know. You know when you're going out for dinner at like, I think we're meeting up at like six-ish. So you know when you, like you know you're going out for dinner, like you're a bit hungry, like you've had breakfast. But you're like, what can I have now? Because I don't want toast again. Like I want pasta and a leg. But that is so filling, so I'm like, it's a bit of an awkward time, isn't it? Because I'm going to have to start getting ready soon, realistically. I think I've been going out, like, every single day that I kind of knew, I kind of do just want to, like, have a movie day. <laughs> but that's going to be boring for you guys to watch. Like, <sighs> my probably will have one sitting. So me and Georgia are meeting up for dinner, and then we're going to Shoreditch. I've never been out in Shoreditch, I don't think. We're going to Shoreditch, and it is a Friday night. It's Friday night. I'm getting right. So I'm not in a mood to be going out at all. Do you know what I mean by that? You know, if you know, you know. But Georgia does have work in the morning, which is good because then I think that will keep us tame. And I want to be tame, but sometimes you can't help it. I just talk a lot. Yeah, I really talk a lot. I'm breaking out so much, guys. This is really bugging me. It's like a fat under the skin spot. I'm just not feeling myself today. <laughs> and I didn't think to turn out anything. <laughs> we all have these times, especially in winter. Let's normalize being ugly in winter. I've got the winter ugly. Um, I want a kind of Coke. I just really fancy a nice cold drink. Last night when I got to Flag and Lettuce, like I really wanted a nice Coca Cola. But I literally downed two glasses of water because I was so thirsty. And then I had a woo woo. Ooh, ooh. I hate ordering those. Hiya, can I get a woo woo, please? God, I am a bit hungry. What am I gonna have? You want a chocolate bar, mate? I want no chocolate bars. Ooh, there's a chocolate muffin. Are these called nice biscuits or nice biscuits? What's so nice about them? All right. Why was the penguin popular? Comment down below your answer. Because he was an ice guy. <laughs> so funny. I am going to start getting ready because I need to leave in like an hour. It's now, oh, okay. It's quarter to five. We're meant to be meeting at six and I just don't know. I was just like laying on my bed watching TikTok. Don't even know what's wrong with me today. I think I've been in a bit of a rut. Like I'm not even hungover or anything. I know I was out last night, but I wasn't tipsy even so i don't know what's going on but i just feel really tired i think it's just because like maybe it's catching up on me because i've been quite busy and trying to get loads done oh I'm human do you know what i mean those vibes i can't do i need to put some makeup on make myself feel better i am so excited for dinner though like i'm really excited to eat have a catch up with georgia we literally haven't seen each other in so long we've seen each other twice in this whole year so this will be the third time so i'm very very excited to see her I have a well needed catch up i feel like my outfit is probably going to be really really basic today so i'm thinking i'm going to do rollers in my hair i did rollers last night when i went out and oh my god it was raining so i stepped foot outside with my north face hood up the most rubbish hood ever and my hair was soaking wet so literally there was no point in me doing rollers i'm gonna try and do a little something today guys i'm really thinking about getting my fringe back but i don't think i should cut it myself because i feel like it's too far gone for me to cut it myself so i'm gonna need to make an appointment to get my fringe cut but i'm really scared they're gonna do it wrong and just do like a full fringe like that i kind of like it like gradually if that makes sense i'm gonna look like the biggest catfish in this video because i'm gonna look totally different once i've got makeup on because girl if i'm not transforming myself i'm not going out do you know what i mean also guys how emotional was these senders so what karen's just left like that karen and mitch they've just left with the kids i'm just like what is gonna happen now do you know what i mean what's a bit emotional watching that episode who do we think is gonna get dead on christmas day though what are the predictions because i really haven't got a clue i also really want jack and stacy 
to be Endgame. But then I love Martin and Stacey, so it's a bit hard that one. Yeah. I'm sorry about this. These rollers are the biggest mess you will ever see. Like, if you ever see anyone do rollers, like, listen, don't copy me when it comes to rollers, okay? Because, but oh well, it's time for makeup, which I bloody need. Like, I cannot wait to get makeup on my face today. And I'm not usually like that. But today, I'm like, get the makeup on me. I already feel really moisturized, but I'm gonna go in with a little bit more. Love it. So, bloody satisfying. As for outfit, Georgia is wearing, oh, uh, Georgia is wearing like the cutest outfit. Sorry, I cannot talk while I'm <laughs> moisturizing my neck. She told me earlier that she's gonna be wearing like tights, leather shorts, cute top, boots. Like she's gonna look so cute and wintry. But I really haven't got anything special to wear. Like, don't know what I'm gonna do. We'll work it out. It's been so cold today. Like I haven't even been out of the house, but literally from just having my windows open. And the thing is with me, as soon as I get up and open my curtain, my windows are open. Like, I'm opening those windows no matter how cold it is because I need to let fresh air in. Like, I've just closed the windows because I closed the curtains, but now I'm getting hot even though it's bloody freezing cold out, out there. I look like Casper, the friendly ghost. We need as much glow as we can get because right now, it's not happening. The winter sun is just not, it's not giving. I look like... I never do this, but before I put on my tinted moisturizer, I'm actually gonna conceal like all <laughs> the horrible bits that I hate, all my little blemishes. So down here, because there's so much redness around that, I'm gonna put a little bit on this one. Got some up here, but I'm scared if I put concealer there, it's gonna ruin the bronzer that goes up there. I feel like I used to always film and get ready with me, like for any occasion in my videos before, I'd always upload them to YouTube. I feel like that's why I don't anymore, like I don't ever upload get ready with me on my youtube anymore because i used to do it so so often now we're ready for this oh my favorite one i'm not even gonna lie is this laura mercier one but i feel like it's the tiniest bit too dark for my pale skin like this is perfect for when i fake tan i think so i'm gonna use this one and i hope it works with my pale skin i think i used this one yesterday as well actually love it gorgeous blum, 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 blum. it's literally like fake tan season and i'm not even fake tanning i love a bit of fake tan in summer though like it was getting my legs out bang slap a bit of fake tan on it sorted mate i wanna be <laughs> bronzer of course we need it Let's hope this can get rid of the bag. My eyes. Love Vermont. Season another stick. I'm gonna get a little bit of blush back in those cheeks because I think that concealer really just washed me out. We need to look healthy, please. <laughs> mm -hmm. Sing it, sing it, baby. Guys, I've got such a dilemma. I'm sorry, I've there's there's been progress. <laughs> I don't know what in the world I'm gonna wear. Oh my god, look at that nose. That's awful. Wow, I need to fix that. Georgia is basically ready, so she's gonna be leaving any minute now. She looks really dressy and beautiful, and now I wanna look dressy and match the vibes, but like, don't think I'm gonna be able to. I'm such a mess. I've just um, found some tan tights that I have. Well, one, they're not even tan tights, they're brown tights, but I was thinking maybe I could make them work, but I was just pulling them up. Got a bloody ladder in them already, so they're a no no. I was thinking I could like, finesse it and pretend I've got lovely tan legs. Also, my legs aren't even shaved. I'm telling you, the hairs are like this long and thick. It's awful. It's so, so awful. I can't. I absolutely can't. I really can't. I've just put the second pair of these on and I've ripped them again. <laughs> Only me. This has been a mission and a half, I'll be honest. I've literally tried on pretty much everything I own. And I feel like this is probably my favorite and I feel really cutesy in it, but the girly stink, a plain black dress look type of thing with like knee high boots. But I do you love this? It makes you feel like Comfy. Alrighty guys, let's take out these rollers. I don't know, they've been through it. They've really been through it all. So, I don't know how they're gonna turn out. But we shall see. This is the moment of truth. Mm. Oh, a bit of a mess. Mm. A mess. Oh, they actually kind of hurt to take out guys, I'm not even gonna lie to you. I always forget to like twist them so they actually curl up. Pull them straight down so it kind of does nothing. I hate these little ones. They always hurt so bad to take out. Ow. They catch on to like every single little bit of hair. Ah, that one hurts. Ow. This one's called like all my baby hairs. Okay, I'll be honest, this one's gonna have to say it. And this is why I don't really do anything with my hair. That's not normal, I'm telling you. That hurt like a bitch. Okay, it looks a bit just like a big mess. What do you think? <laughs> Look at this one, she's in her own world. I'm not sure how to feel. I think it looks a bit of a mess, but at least I've got some volume because my hair is usually so, so flat looking. I'm actually gonna put like one little roller here because I think this side is looking a little bit more flat. <laughs> What is she doing? Do we go basic with the hoops or do we go little like 
pretty dangly ones. I kind of think hoops, you know. But then I'm like, these will like make me. I feel like these are more classy. Maybe I'll go with these. We want to be classy. I also need to put my Tiffany bracelet on, but I'm like, it's like impossible to do yourself because the little clasp is so so tiny. I'm surprised George is not here by now. Actually, she's on her way in a cab. Pretty sure she always gets lost around here though. <laughs> this is gonna have to bloody do. I don't know where to wear these little knee high boots. I feel like these are more classy looking, or my Lamoda ones, which are a bit more chunky. Also, I'm trying to clean up as I go along because I don't want to come home to like a mess of a room. That is like the worst thing ever after getting ready. I've been thinking about our dinner since like I woke up this morning. Look who I'm with. We're reunited. We got some lovely Mexican food. I also got my chicken pitas. What did you get? Enchilada. She got chicken enchilada. We got some onion rings. My hair has dropped out. We knew that was going to happen. But I'm so excited to eat this. I'm literally looking forward to it all day long. They just gave us two strawberry lattes while we're waiting for our bill. What do you think, G? Nice. Oh my god, that's lovely. That is really nice. So late for our booking at the bar that we're meant to be going to. It's 20 past 8 right now. We've got it booked from 8. And it's going to take us like a half an hour to get there. We haven't even paid the bill yet. So, love it. We're literally an hour late to our booking at Barrio, so luckily we got our table. We were so scared that like we were too late for our table. We've had a passion fruit martini each and we've had a prosecco each. Um, that's it, isn't it? Yeah. That is. Yeah. And now we've just got a Maria Maria and a Sangria. Maria. <laughs> Let's do a taste test. What, what, what are your thoughts? It's so healthy. Oh, <laughs> that's so cringe. I meant like so cute. 